Hello Capricorn, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of hmm, June 10th through the 17th, 2019. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid Cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I'm closing off with my Wild Unknown Tarot by Kim Kranz. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, and subscribing and setting up personal readings with me. Let's get this show on the road. All right. What's going on with the Capricorn? Already I'm feeling like something is missing. Something is missing. Something is not right, okay? Capricorn. All right. So I just saw the separation card. So I feel like it may be some kind of unwanted separating. Um, maybe it could have been a trip. It could have been an actual breakup. It could have been anything, okay? But I feel like something is not right about the whole situation, okay? All right, so we got the Coral Wisdom. So um, I heard acting funny. So I feel like somebody has been acting funny for the last three months. Um, or this is a short-term relationship. Six months or less, okay? Definitely less than a year, all right? All right, so Atlantis. So this makes me feel like whatever has happened, I feel like the relationship happened fast. Or just the attitude, the situation just happened, like, fast. And it, it just, like... Everything is okay. Then next thing you know, somebody's going on a trip and they're going to be gone for months or years or weeks, okay? That's the feeling. I feel like somebody maybe just got getting deployed or something. I don't know. All right, yes. Yeah, so I am getting the feeling somebody just keep leaving and coming back. Leaving and coming back. So I do feel like this may be like some kind of work situation. But whatever is going on, I feel like this last one, it just happened too fast. Like, it, like what's going on? Okay. All right. So I feel like, of course, you really care about this person. I also feel like this could be a child's parent too. Um, but I feel like, yeah, you really care about this person and this person is gone and it's like, come on, come back already. Okay. Okay. Yes. So I do feel like it's a whole lot of stuff about moving about separation, about relocating, okay? So I feel like either somebody moved out fast or somebody moved in and moved out. Um, I feel like somebody could have, y'all could have just moved into somewhere and then they had to go. But I feel like whatever it is, I feel like somebody was just snatched out of um, whatever was going on, okay? Snatched out of the relationship, okay? I feel like somebody was snatched out. All right, so we got the siren of the song. Yeah, song of the siren. So this makes me feel like, um, I do feel like you're getting messages. I feel like these you're getting messages about what's going on, what's happening, why all this is happening. Let's see what this siren is talking about. Ooh. All right, so, all right, so this is too many. So we're going to put these back, but I feel like they all together. This could be just for one person, okay? This doesn't have to be for everybody uh, just because the way they feel. So I feel like some of you guys are having dreams, having feelings, daydreams, nightmares about somebody that you're dealing with. I feel like this person right here, this is not everybody, but this person is very arrogant, okay? And I feel like somebody is having dreams that this person is dealing with somebody else, um, and I feel like they are, okay? I feel like whatever these dreams they are, they're 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 real. Okay. And then I feel like for others of you, I think you just having um grown up dreams. Okay. A lot of grown up dreams like this person is really there. Okay. Uh I feel like you waking up and this person isn't there. And I feel like all that happiness and passion from the dream turns turns to sadness. Like right now I just want to start crying. Like, why couldn't it be real? You know, why didn't I I couldn't just stay stay asleep, okay? Somebody really wanted to stay asleep. All right, Capricorn. All right. So, I feel like somebody is giving up on this whole situation. Um, I just feel like somebody's giving up of a, quote, normal lifestyle, okay? I feel like somebody's understanding that um, dealing with the situation with this person 
with their job. I feel like they got to move around a whole lot, okay? Always on and off, in and out. You know, I feel like somebody very, very, very much in love, but I do feel like somebody is... Um, I feel like a little bit of depression coming here. I do feel like somebody just wants to let go of everything, okay? Because this is the letting go card. I feel like whoever this is, I do feel sick. Um, I do feel like for some of you guys, there's children. And I feel like for others, there's pregnancies, okay? All right, let's see what's at the bottom of here. All right, so we got the sacrifice card here. So it seems like somebody... It's just not willing to make this sacrifice right now. Somebody's giving up. They just like whatever is whatever. Whatever happens. Whatever is going on is what's going on. I do feel like somebody is definitely longing for someone to come back. Okay. Um, but I do feel like this is messing with someone in like a whole new level. I feel like somebody is not eating. I, of course, the dreams... Um, they like so real when you wake up they're not real and then it it, it makes you sad and it, i just feel i just feel sick okay sick because like i get i guess love sick okay all right what's going on with the capricorn what's going on with the capricorn capricorn love reading June 10th through 17th, 2019. What's going on with the Capricorn? Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. What's going on? All right. All right, so we got the Ten of Swords here. So I do feel like somebody feels betrayed, okay? All right, so I do feel like maybe some kind of promise was made. Oh, I'm not going to leave all of a sudden. No, that, that's too many. This is enough right here. It's just one. Um, I do feel like somebody said they wasn't leaving anymore. I feel like somebody had to leave. I feel like somebody may have had to leave for money issues, okay? Somebody's bringing in the money. Okay, so they got to go. Got to go. But I do feel like somebody's starting to be feel betrayed i do feel like some of you guys are getting in your mind about the situation and um flipping it all kinds of ways you know and i feel like some of you guys are doing this to um make yourself stronger so you can get away because right now you don't want to end the situation but it's just like it's beating you up okay so i do feel like some of you guys are trying to find a way out all right so we got the moon card, so it seems like some kind of secrets is getting ready to come out. Um, some kind of secrets, and I feel like these secrets may be betrayal, okay? Mm. All right, so we got the nine of swords reversed here. Um, so I do feel like some of you guys, them dreams from earlier, remember those three cards came out? I do feel like some of these dreams are getting ready to come true, okay? Somebody's about to find out that these dreams were real. Okay, but I feel like whatever happens, it's going to help you guys get over the anxiety. Okay, over the hurt feelings. All right. Let's see what this Ten of Swords is. One card for the Capricorn. All right. Yes. This. Wow. Um. There is a lot of love in this situation, but I do feel like this betrayal for some of you guys is going to bring a better future. Um, somebody just wants to know what's going on, what what's happening. I feel like some of you guys are want to do this because you feel like you need a better reason to leave, okay, other than you're unhappy. All right, I need something else. Uh, but it seems like whatever's going on with this backstabbing or betrayal, it's going to lead to better times in the future, okay? All right, let's go on this. Better times, either with or without this person, all right? All right, let's see what this 10. Because this betrayal right here doesn't have to just be um, someone cheating. It, it, I keep hearing hurt. I feel like somebody could uh, be going through some kind of surgery or going through something like that. And I feel like this person may be trying to keep that a secret from you, okay? Um 
Yeah, but it seems like whatever this is, it's going to cause situations to be better. Wow. Okay, so I just saw like a little shadow peek from around the corner. So I do feel like there might have been some kind of near-death experience going on uh, for some of you. Of course, it's not everybody. And I feel like it's a part of this betrayal. I feel like somebody did not want to um, say anything or bring anything up because they knew that it, it uh, altered a relationship and they didn't want to hurt you. They didn't want to do that, okay? All right, so let's see what this secret is. All right, that one flew all the way over there. All right, so we got the Knight of Pentacles here. Hmm. Okay, so I do feel like some kind of money is getting ready to come in. I do feel like some kind of rank, a rank up or something is getting ready to come in. I feel like somebody um, didn't want to say anything about this. All right. This also makes me feel like somebody may have taken a another job. I feel like whatever this job is, it, it I feel like you guys talked about it and it wasn't supposed to happen. Okay, but I feel like it's getting ready to happen and it's crazy. I do feel like it's going to bring better times. So maybe um, it's more dangerous, but I do feel like um, the person you're dealing with is going to be closer to you. Okay. All right. Let me try to get this card that flew across the floor all right so it was over there sideways so um seven of wands this makes me feel like i feel like somebody was fighting hard for something and i feel like somebody is just trying to see where it's getting ready to go i do feel like somebody's been fought, fighting emotionally too um this makes me feel like i do feel like both sides are getting ready to let go i feel like if the person that keeps disappearing doesn't get what they want from the outside. I do feel like they're going to come back to um, the to the main uh, relationship, the main situation. Okay, but I feel like I do feel like success is coming. So whatever this person was trying to get on the outside, I do feel like they're going to be successful. Okay, and I do feel like you're going to be successful too um, in this fight. Uh, in this emotional fight you got going on, okay? All right, let's see what this Nine of Swords reversed. All right, Six of Wands. Like I said, you guys are going to be successful, okay? So it seems like whatever you guys are trying to do and, and, and pushing for right now, I do feel like it's going to be success coming for, for, the, uh, for the future. I do feel like there's a little deceit going on. I feel like somebody is trying to care for someone's feelings, but I also feel like, I feel like whatever it is, is for the better of the relationship, okay? And then I feel like uh, the person that's at home, they're getting their self hard, okay? They're hardening their shell so that when this person do leave and come, they won't be as um, anxious and as nervous and as um, depressed, Okay, so I do feel like you guys are um, headed on the right track, okay? All right, let's see what this is. All right. So, it seems like some kind of freedom is getting ready to happen from this. I feel like mentally, um, you guys are going to be free from whatever is uh, burdening you right now. Okay, you're going to realize this uh, situation isn't a trap, okay? You, you're going to look at it in a different light, like it's not as bad as I think it is, or... Um, when it comes to the person that's getting a job, like finally, you know, I'm here. I don't have to fight anymore. I'm free. I can do what I want and I don't have to just be yanked all around the world. Okay. World, state, wherever. Okay. But I do feel like emotional success here. All right. But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.